So I've gone and bought a, a PDF models kit. The um, form of this locomotive just appealed to me. And so uh, I splashed out and got the kit for around about a hundred pounds. It's made by PDF models. And there we see a main picture of it. And you can go to their website and see more pictures of the thing. What it is, is it's a mixed media model. Uh, so what you've got is 3D printed parts, uh, the uh, smoke box, the boiler, the firebox, uh, one of the domes, the cylinders, uh, and some spaces underneath which space the frames apart. And it also includes laser cut acrylic sheet, uh, which um, are these thin flat sheets that's uh, best done out of that. And it also includes some resin cast parts. So you'll see the smoke box door there is a resin cast part. So uh, that's it. And um, that's my next little project. I think this one is going to be up and running well before my brass loco body um, because I'm more confident at making these uh, little kits. Just a little note, you see each of these rivets, they're individually applied. They're not molded into the plastic. Uh, just a reminder, uh, you'll have possibly seen a previous video and up there on the shelf, been round the garden, is the Swift 16 kit for a well wagon. Now that was a much simpler and lower cost kit and on it you will see some containers from Playmobil and so that went together uh, very nicely and I'm pleased with the way that kit turned out. So that was a kit there from, uh, Play not from Playmobil, the kit came from Swift 16 and this is the work table where I've begun the work and what you will see in the next video uh, because I'm going to try and keep the videos short and sweet is uh, the process I go through because the instructions so I've moved the instructions to read wherever I moved them to doesn't matter um, there they are uh, explain about how it goes together but they didn't have uh, a picture in the instructions of the general arrangement um, which I'll explain why I was interested in seeing that, so I've gone back to it. So I hope you enjoy looking at this, and I've kept this video for once down to three minutes.